Welcome or welcome back on C Square. In this video clip, we will talk about factoring uh, polynomial using a uh, very important pattern uh, perfect square. Okay, so let's see the first example uh, x squared minus 12x plus 36. First of all, I'm going to show you something that I did in a previous video clip the diamond problem 36 and negative 12. The product is 36 and the sum is negative 12, and those are the Negative 6 and negative 6, right? Negative 6 times negative 6 is, neg is positive 36. And uh, when you add them, negative 6 plus negative 6, negative 12. So the answer obviously is x minus 6. x minus 6, if we follow a previous video clip, or x minus 6 squared. And you notice this is what we call a perfect square, right? Why? Because we have this uh, 2 on top. And for that reason, we do have a shortcut. Yes, it is a shortcut that I would like to set. Right. For me, first time, first first uh, uh, red flag is when I see that 36, because I know that 36 is nothing else than 6 squared, right? Uh, and then I'll look to the first guy, which is uh, x squared, right? x squared, and uh, that guy, it's uh, pretty simple, is the quantity x squared. And then that negative 12x, or positive 12x, uh, uh, sometimes you can get a plus one, and that is a product of negative two, right? Times six times x. And if these three conditions are accomplished, then you have a perfect square. So we have x minus six square. Okay. So for instance, in this case, we can use the diamond problem. However, I think the best way to to, to take a look is what one forty four is. 12 square. x square is the quantity x square. And 24x is nothing else than the product of 2, always that 2, times 12 times x. So, yes, the gentleman on top is x plus 12 square. And these are very good example where this shortcuts works fast. Again, what square is 9? What square is 4x squared? If you answer to this question very fast, you do have the answer, right? 9 is the quantity 3 squared. 4x squared is the quantity 2x squared. So the answer will be 2x minus 3 square or at least we think in this moment don't forget to check the third condition is important because if the third condition is not accomplished then that answer is wrong negative 12 is the product of negative 2 3 and 2x yeah all these conditions are very important you need to check them at least mentally in order to write the uh, factor for uh, pause this video clip and do number 78 If you have this answer, 3x plus 1 squared, then you did a wonderful job. Okay. Moreover, these problems are very uh, impressive, scary sometimes for, for some students, right? But again, if you take a look, it, they are very uh, simple. In fact, why? 9x squared is the quantity 3x squared. The 25y squared is the quantity 5y squared. So right away, I have in my mind the answer, this answer. Don't forget to check the third condition. See if the negative 30xy is the result of the product of negative 2 times 3x times 5y. In this case, we do have that. Oh, yes, the answer is good. Pause these video clips and try number 80.
if you already have the answer for x plus 3y squared, that, that is fine. Again, mental math you can do here. Uh, let me write it 4x squared. The quantity 4x squared is 16x squared. 3y squared is, the quantity 3y squared is 9y squared. And 24xy is the product of 2, 4x, and 3y. If you enjoyed this uh, video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C-Square for more math video clip. Thank you.